Howdy! So this is my first video with the new tripod. Hopefully it works out well. Pardon the mess, but it's just how the garage is. Um, I'll take care of it sometime. So this video is in response to uh, Harshman Hills. I'll tag his channel video below. Um, basically he did a test with a Trangia stove and Everclear to see how long it would take to boil 12 ounces of water. He took, uh, or sorry, in his test, it took 19 minutes. Um, I know I've done this test before, but I don't remember the results. So I'm going to try to just replicate what he did and kind of see how, you know, it comes out. He used 45 milliliters of Everclear, which is just under a quarter cup. And he did 12 ounces of water, which is a cup and a half. So we'll be putting those in the handy dandy trusty bot. Um, you know, it's not going to be exact replication of his test because, of course, different areas, different temperatures, different air pressures, different, different water temperatures, different uh, vessels. So we'll try and this will get as close as possible. See if we can beat that in 19 minutes because that seems a little high for, uh, for the Everclear. So we'll see what happens. Stay tuned. And yes, I need a haircut really bad. All right. So first up, we have the same stove, a Trangia. That is something we can uh, replicate. We're going to go ahead. Get this Everclear. And we're just under this quarter cup go ahead and get that in there so 45 milliliter doesn't seem a lot like a lot Ugh. okay go ahead and put that up there next we got the box Cup and a half of water coming up. Okay, half one half. These are all room temperature. Okay, go ahead and put the pot stand on there. go hopefully that goes maybe not because uh, it's just a little on the outside didn't get inside yeah 45 milliliters not a lot so kind of hard to get the lighter down in there come on there we go okay That on there. Got the famous broken iPad. And let's see how long it takes. Okay, so here we are at four minutes. Um, I thought I saw a little flare up from the uh, the alcohol stove there so kind of makes me worried that you know 45 uh, milliliters isn't enough but we'll see well got some some steam and some bubbles little bubbles but let's see if we can get a real boil going Okay, here we are, almost eight and a half minutes. Uh, it was eight minutes, 24 seconds when I started hearing. I don't know if you can hear that. But it sounds like it's starting to boil. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and check. Yeah. So we do have bubbles rising, um, small ones rising at a good basis. So 
Let's wait till we get a good, strong rolling boil. Okay, so this actually started at about 10 minutes and 30 seconds, but I decided to give it a little more time. But I think in probably have a pretty good boil. Yep, there we go. It's 11 minutes and yep. Okay, so we're still still going. Uh, 12 minutes now. Uh, I don't know if you can see that. I don't know why it's white on the See, there it is, 12 minutes. Say 12 minutes. Anyway, some uh, things, I mean, 12 minutes, I guess, is still going. Um, some things I've learned from this or thought of, um, I'm surprised 45 milliliters of Everclear is going this long. Um, I thought it would have been, you know, maybe up before it actually boiled because it didn't seem like a lot. But surprisingly, it's, it's going pretty decent. Um, also, some reasons why my results could, are different is, besides what I already discussed at the beginning, um, I might be spaced a little better than he was. Um, I'm not sure how, I can't remember how far he was spaced. That, that could be a difference as well. Also, one big thing I didn't mention at the beginning is I'm using titanium. I think he was using stainless steel, so that definitely could add a couple minutes. Um, but... You know, we did beat the 19 at, you know, 10 and a half for a strong boil. Um, still, you know, a little longer than, you know, the yellow heat that people use. But, you know, still pretty good. So we'll just see how long that goes for. Almost 13 and a half minutes now. I don't know why it's not showing up very well on the camera now that I changed position. See, 13. Okay, it's starting to fade. And we are at 30 minutes. Yeah, 30 minutes. And it's starting to fade. Which, I'm surprised. I really don't remember this little amount lasting that long. Um, kind of makes me wonder, do I really need this big of a bottle to, to carry it while camping and stuff? Um, even for long trips, I mean, this might be a little much. This is the... 20 ounce or 591 milliliter and we're at over half an hour for you know 45 milliliters so this might be a bit overkill might have to downgrade to the smaller one um, probably won't be upgrading to the bigger one or maybe i will just for storage and fun um, so this is almost out at almost out getting close to 32 minutes now so pretty impressive oh also another thing i noticed and you probably can can see it here is uh, I didn't have my pot stand securely on. Oops, my bad. So always check your stuff. Anyway, get outside, enjoy life, and hey, science. It's officially burning out at 34 and. Thirty-seven seconds. Check out all these videos floating around here for other great content. Also, be sure to like, share, subscribe, hit that bell notification, comment. Check out the links below. It all helps the channel and the family. Every little bit.